All right, I need to talk to y'all a second with because this stupid piece of trash. So, first of all, hi. I recorded two videos today. Uh, the first one was just straight up Halo Reach. And then it turns out that the game just wasn't recording at all. Like, it froze on the start menu screen. You could see, still see the mouse cursor moving around on the screen, but nothing else. And then the second time I recorded, everything was laggy. Even, okay, the gameplay in Reach, the first recording, not laggy whatsoever. It was going so smooth. It was flawless. Then... Uh, I also had my controller hooked up to my laptop via Bluetooth. And then randomly, while I was playing Halo, it decided to disconnect. So, then I tried it again. It reconnected to the computer. Second recording, game footage so laggy. The first, uh, like, 10 seconds after the cutscene took about 30 seconds to pass by. So that means it was running... Th like two or three times slower than it normally would everything was super choppy so i said screw it let's let's record a game that doesn't have as many graphical requirements that isn't gonna eat up the computer that much i decided to play fall guys the gameplay so smooth just fine it recorded just fine too and by recorded just fine, I mean it actually showed the gameplay for the first five minutes. And then you know what it decided to do? It started to get super laggy to the point where one frame per five seconds was happening. I wish I was kidding. So, I just had to go in and optimize my computer and OBS to hopefully record better. And if it doesn't work, I don't know what I'm going to do. Because one thing I've been noticing, Minecraft's been getting super laggy, and Outlast has been get getting super laggy. But the problem is, whenever I first started back, they weren't laggy. And this was also whenever, like, I've been using the same settings since I've came back. I have not changed any settings on my computer or OBS whatsoever. Everything's been the exact same. I changed everything, but it is super late. I do not want to record again. I am frustrated. I will be angry the entire time I am recording. And that's not what I want to do. So tomorrow night, I'm going to record Outlast. No matter how much it lags, I am still going to edit it and I'm going to upload it. I, I just don't care at this point. And whenever I say I don't care, I mostly mean... I won't be able to go back and undo my progress because it auto-saves so often. So, what it boils down to is hopefully these setting changes worked to make the footage less laggy because apparently it was an OBS problem. I looked it up. This was a massive problem for many, many other people. And there were multiple tutorials showing how to fix it. So, it's definitely not OBS. Resolve, I wouldn't think that it's Resolve, but who knows? I mean, it, it could be. It could be DaVinci Resolve. But either way, it's annoying. Three weeks in a row now saying that I won't have a video coming out Friday. <laughs> because I want to hold myself to a schedule. I know if I start getting off schedule too much that it'll become a habit. And then it'll go back to the exact same thing that happened every other time that I started getting more active. And I would just drop it. I would stop uploading. I would just, I would lose interest. And I'm trying not to lose interest. This is something I really do want to do. I'm really starting to enjoy it again. I'm enjoying video editing. I'm enjoying recording. I'm enjoying commentating what I'm recording. But the problem is... That the recording process is just not working the way it should. And it's extremely frustrating to have every recording look like it's coming out okay, but then come out so laggy and even cutting off the end of the recording so often that it's just almost unusable at this point. I, ha I said this in Minecraft, I want to try to buy a gaming PC... And by that, I mean I want to build it because I know that buying a pre-made gaming PC isn't recommended. It's recommended that you build your own. The problem with that is 
with the stuff that I wanted, it is currently about $1,500. And no, this is not me asking for money. I am not going to be posting any sort of GoFundMe or Patreon. I am going to work up to this myself. But the reason I'm bringing up how much it costs is because with how much it costs, it is going to take months, even upwards to a year and a half, to do this. I, I wish I could get it done sooner, but I just, I really can't. Um, I might try to look up cheaper gaming PC builds, but this has 16 gigs of RAM, and it slows down whenever I'm running OBS and one game. So I know I need at least 32 <laughs> to do what I'm doing. 16 is not cutting it like everyone said it would. And when I say everyone, I mean I didn't really ask too many people I just sort of assumed, oh yeah, 8 gigabytes can run crappy games, 16 should be able to run 4K games and a recording uh, software. So yeah, I want to try to get a PC that's at least 32 gigabytes and has a good CPU and a good core, good motherboard, all that type of stuff. Because as much as this is okay for what it is right now, if I do want this channel to get better, I want to make sure that the footage is not extremely laggy all the time. No one in the future is going to want to look at laggy footage. No one now really wants to look at laggy footage. I'm pretty sure that because the game footage lags so much is one reason why people aren't really watching full videos. I mean, it could be another reason, but the, the reason I'm mostly chalking it up to is just... It's so laggy and choppy to watch. I will watch it back after I edit it, and I think, man, this is painful to watch. I couldn't imagine too many other people watching it. But again, I still want to stay in the loop of uploading so I don't get unmotivated and just stop. Like, there are plenty of other things that I would enjoy doing, but I want YouTube to be able in the future to be able to be a career. I want to be able to make a living off of this. I want to be able to do this full time as long as I can because I enjoy it that much. So, uh, I will try to look for cheaper stuff so that way maybe I can get a cheaper gaming computer at least to start off with. I'm not saying that this computer I'm going to get is going to be like the see-all, end-all of the computers I ever get. But that's what it's boiling down to, is I have to get it. Just to be able to run the most basic stuff. Unless OBS is fixed after all the changes I did, because after the multiple videos I watched that said to do the same things, I haven't tried recording yet. It's late. I don't want to. <laughs> so... I'm sorry. I am very sorry that this is the third week in a row that there is not a video. I mean, a gaming video, that is. I've been posting this ugly face three weeks in a row. That counts. But, yeah, hopefully I can get it to work. Because I also got a couple of games on here that I want to be able to play on the channel. And right now, I mean, it just feels like I won't be able to. So, stay tuned. I will record Outlast tomorrow night. Hopefully, it works out really well. That would be the best thing in the world, is if it just goes smoothly. And I don't have to stress and worry about getting a gaming PC any faster. Because, like I said, as much as I want it, it is going to be expensive. And that's money that I could be putting towards other things. Not necessarily just for the channel, but if I want to be able to move out of my dad's house, down payment on an apartment, and then rent. So, I'll try, for sure. Also, I'm sorry this video isn't really edited down. I'm lazy. I don't feel like editing after the editing I was doing earlier. It's ridiculous. And I feel like you guys do at least have the right to uh, 
see what I mean whenever I say the footage is extremely laggy and choppy in editing. So let me open Resolve. I would just flip the camera, but that would mean editing. So opening Resolve right now, it's all fine and dandy. We'll go into uh, the video that I was editing, the video that was going to be Halo that turned into Fall Guys. Let's see here. Halo refused to be recorded, so here's a Fall Guys video. That's literally what the title was going to be. Alright, so let's just back up a little bit. I'd like to see... no! Okay. That is actually not a good example of lag, but it's still pretty laggy. That I was playing with there. So see Trash. here... I never want to see you again, okay? It's already slightly laggy. And that's on a screen where there's no gameplay. So let's go here. That, again, looks just fine. Loading screen. And now, whenever we get into the game, it is lagging. And there we go. This isn't an example where it's one frame every five seconds. But this is an example of just how choppy the footage came out and why I just really do not feel comfortable editing this. I mean, look at it. It's probably running at like one to five frames a second at this specific moment. It's showing 30 frames a second up here, which is why I don't think it's Resolve. I think it was just an OBS issue because if it was a Resolve issue this up here would be showing something different. I know you can't see it, but that's how many frames per second the video is being shown at. So, that is the reason I, I just, I, I can't. It's, it's not worth it. It's not good footage. It's, half of it is unusable. Like, at the beginning, whenever I first start, it's good. Like, even this. This is just a loading screen, and it's frozen, and then, boom, pops into the screen just like that. That's how much lag there is. There you go. That is an example of... That's one frame not even every five seconds, because five seconds already passed. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. This also just mostly became a rant. And it is long, but again, I'm too tired and too lazy to edit anything down after this frustration that I had to go through. So, I will see you guys on Sunday whenever the Outlast video is uploaded. Uh, and hopefully the Outlast video comes out better. Thank you guys so much. And I will see you guys next time. See ya.